historic, epic, grand, an assembly of world changers, drinking from the deepest fountains of wisdom. When men gathered, time stood still. When men gathered, destiny sang a new song. When men gathered, the nations took notice. A man is a worker. If you find yourself doing nothing, you are disobeying God. Work means producing either service or a commodity for the good of others. When there is need, you put labor. How many push-ups do you think you can do? 15. 70 years old, he can do 15 push-ups. 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 15. Yeah! <laughs> Mr. Kenya, just tell us how you're able to do this kind of thing at your age. Right is the word. I can do all things through him who gives me strength. Hallelujah! He's my daddy, yeah. I can fly away. Branded for excellence. Fashion is really a visual expression of the inner you in terms of the clothes you wear. Remember that brands are promises. What promises are we making through the outfits that we wear? Men at the center of economic revolution. Knowing the history as a continent, as a country, Uganda, a flourishing country, promising, take charge of your life, use your time well. Let's do things differently. Let's change Uganda. Because as sure as the sun rises from the east, Uganda will rise one day. Men who know God. The gospel is the power of God unto salvation. When Moses tells God, show me your glory, there is something he's asking for. There was something Moses wanted God to bless inside him, that if that thing settles inside him, it's called the word of God. He says the words that I speak to you, they are spirit and they are like every man seated right here. You're shaping the DNA of your child. You're shaping the DNA of your grandchildren. That is the power of the word of God. It can transcend beyond generations. He said the blessing of God is to a thousand generations. That means you can receive one scripture like this. And it changes how your son thinks, how your children think, how your children's children think. One word like this. Fanero, make manifest.